untold saga of the Native Americans after battling Vikings. It is not only one of the conflicts, it is also one of adaptation and coexistence. A story of two distinct worlds colliding with each other, fighting, and finally learning from each other. Ultimately, these worlds will leave an indelible mark on each other's stories, and that is the story you will be listening to today. The Untold Saga The Native Americans had been living in harmony with the land for generations, right in the midst of dense North American forests. As they went about their lives in the whispers of the trees and ancient secrets, they never imagined that life as they knew it would change forever. This change occurred with the arrival of the Vikings, seafaring adventurers from the far reaches of Europe, with the following targets in mind, raiding, trading, and looting. Their arrival marked a huge milestone in the history of the Native Americans. The arrival of the Vikings brought an era of resilience, adaptation, and cultural exchange to the Native Americans, and the inevitable clash that followed was unimaginable and cost a lot of lives in its way. The Arrival of the Vikings According to history, Thorfinn Karlsefni, a Viking trader and explorer, led the Vikings' arrival in America. He set off with three ships and a band of Norse warriors in search of a new land that was supposed to be filled with riches. You see, the Vikings had a pillaging and nomadic form of living that involved going from one place to another, fighting, and taking whatever they could from people they were stronger than. He followed the same routes used by Leif Erikson and sailed up Greenland's coast. He went through the Davis Strait and turned south past Baffin Island to Newfoundland. There, the Vikings found themselves in North America. They invaded and battled with the North American natives. We all know the Vikings for their bold and adventurous spirit, but I can bet you didn't know that the Vikings came to the Americas before Columbus. In fact, they beat them there by over 400 years. So, why did their encounter turn out bloody? Why did they not live with the Native Americans in peace? In 1000 AD, the Americans were cut off from Eurasia for almost 12,000 years, and this was when the Vikings arrived. At this time, Eric the Red had started his movement to colonize Greenland, and the Vikings found themselves in North America. However, they did not stay long. The Vikings' encounters with the Native Americans led to the legendary battle with the Native Americans. But what happened to the Native Americans after battling the Vikings? Were the Vikings able to find the riches they were seeking? This question is important because it determines the next events that happened to the Native Americans after the Vikings' arrival. Thorfinn and his band found the riches they sought. The land was filled with game, fish, timber, and pasture, but it was also filled with Native Americans. However, the Vikings did not get along well with the Native Americans. They saw them as wretched people and called them Skrylings, which means wretched people. It is no wonder that the relationship between the Vikings and the Native Americans wasn't rosy. The Vikings have never been known for their good relationships with the people of the lands they try to conquer. Calling the natives Skrylings was not the only harshness they melted on the natives. They took over lands, food, and even gold. This plundering led to conflict and impacted Native Americans in ways they were unprepared for. So the untold saga of the Native Americans after battling the Vikings focuses mainly on the impacts of their arrival. Impact of the arrival of the Vikings on the Native Americans. Imagine a group of wild looking people wearing iron armor and wielding weapons entering your land. That is exactly how the Native Americans felt about the Vikings arrival. And soon afterward, clashes were inevitable. Soon, battles over land and resources emerged as a result of the desire for resources and territorial dominance. Lots of Native Americans lost their lives at the hands of the Vikings. A typical Native American may not be able to defeat a Viking in one-on-one -on -one combat. This is due to the physical characteristics of the Vikings. As seafarers and warriors, they have heavily built muscles and endurance. These attributes come in handy while fighting, so we can say that it did not look good for the Native Americans. In the battles that ensued, the Native American warriors used their intimate knowledge of the land to their advantage and employed very cunning tactics. Even the Vikings, renowned for their seafaring prowess, could not match the Native Americans in their dense forests, treacherous swamps, and towering mountains. They were as formidable as any army. However, the Native Americans eventually succeeded in chasing the Vikings off their lands. But something extraordinary had happened before that. They had unconsciously assimilated some of the cultures and technologies into their way of life. Here are some of the ways battling the Vikings impacted the Native Americans. Curiosity The Native Americans always prided themselves on their spiritual connection with the earth, and this connection piqued their curiosity. They became intrigued by these newcomers. These strangers have intricate ship designs, craftsmanship, and stories of distant lands and deities. Cultural Exchange Remember that the Vikings were not just mere conquerors. They were also traders who shared tales of their numerous voyages across the Atlantic and the riches of these distant lands. Archaeologists believe that the Vikings shared with the Native Americans their shipbuilding, 
jewelry making, and navigation skills, language. The Native Americans may have also adopted some linguistic characteristics from the Vikings. As language barriers crumbled, there was a lot of exchange of ideas, stories, and techniques that enriched the lives of the Native Americans. Eventually, the presence of the Vikings was reduced due to battles, but the impact of their presence endured. The Native Americans witnessed the adaptability and resilience of these northern invaders and incorporated some of those ideas into their way of life. Iron tools, shipbuilding techniques, and even small elements of Norse mythology can be found in some Native American cultures. Though there were some positive impacts from battling the Vikings, the negative impacts. Although historical records from the Viking period are very few, there is little direct evidence of the exact events that occurred. We already know that the Vikings are very fierce warriors and raiders. They fought first and asked questions later. And this is what happened. There were outbreaks of conflict between the Vikings and the natives. Those conflicts caused the loss of lives, displacements, and disruptions to the native way of life. The Vikings also brought diseases with them. They introduced diseases that the Native Americans had no immunity to protect them from. Researchers believe this is one reason for the significant reduction of the indigenous population. Another impact was the effect the Viking battles had on resources. The aim of the Viking expeditions was to find resources. These include timber, furs, gold, etc. After the battles, the Native Americans saw their resources were looted. The presence of the Vikings put a lot of pressure on the ecosystem which the natives relied on for sustenance. Finally, these battles led to the displacement of many Native American communities from their ancestral lands. It also disrupted their original cultures as new beliefs and technologies started sneaking their way into them. There are lots of different accounts of the battle between the Vikings and the Native Americans, but very little evidence to support the events. The Vikings did not stay long in North America. The Vikings allegedly left North America after three years and moved to Iceland according to Smithsonian museums. Archaeologists have also dug up arrowheads with bruised Norse warriors, so the assumption is that they left after a great battle and a barrage of arrows. What is certain is that the Vikings did not succeed in conquering North America, but left a mark on the natives. The saga is not only one of war and death, as seen in most Viking movies. It is also one of cultural adaptation and coexistence. And as centuries passed, the memory of this encounter faded into time. Yet, its echoes remain heard in many of the Native American traditions and practices. Each group had left an indelible mark on the other's histories. We can see a bit of this leftover mark in the Native American language, culture, and even food. After all, we are the result of our life experiences, which greatly shape us. Every day, new perspectives on the life of the Vikings are being unraveled. And this says a lot about the culture and lifestyle of this amazing and intriguing group of people. So rich in culture, religion, morals, and most of all, their courage. This forgotten chapter of history, this clash of civilizations, gave birth to a remarkable story of resilience, exchange, and endurance by the Native Americans. It shows the capacity of humans to adapt and find ground in the most unexpected circumstances.